We were pretty much coming in with no prior experience and the first day of class he tells us we're going to build an oscillating air engine which we are like, what? <laughs> we go through the whole process of designing them and machining them. Yeah, it's pretty much no guideline. He's like, design it however you want. This is the premise for how it works. Then we get some minimal shop training so that we don't kill ourselves. <laughs> Some hundred odd hours later of design work and shop work, we have a little engine. And then at the Wobble Off, we take them and we test them. It's really fun because of how challenging it is. Especially Washington State University has just a world-renowned engineering program and they don't do anything like this for the freshmen. You might be able to do something similar to like that when you're a junior, but you don't jump into it like you do here, which is really neat. My engineering professor had a really good quote. He said that the difference between mediocre and excellence can sometimes be five hours of work, but it can a lot of times just be five seconds. And if we just put forth that extra effort, uh, you'll be surprised what you can accomplish, and it's totally worth it in the end. The engine project was really amazing, and it's such a neat thing for a freshman to be able to do, especially if you aren't really certain that you want to do engineering. I mean, there's nothing more decisive than a hands-on project like that to really see what you're made of and what you want to do. Coming in, I'm a commuter. I skipped all of freshman year, so I'm coming into classes with students that know each other and live together. And I was kind of feeling like an outsider when I first came, but the students here wouldn't let that happen. <laughs> there was just no way I couldn't be known. <laughs>